Hi everyone. This is Adif Hashmi, your teacher. And today we are going to talk about rural settlements, their types and functions. Before going into the details, get ready your pencil and notebook to take notes. Let's dive into the topic. Rural settlements means settlement in a rural or village like setting. It's a small settlement in a small area that is close to nature and filled with socially homogeneous people. It could be nucleated, dispersed or linear. People have strong relationships and share common interests and basic facilities. And now we are talking about types of rural settlements. There are three types of settlements as we see in our surroundings. The first type is farmstead. It consists of only one house. And the second one is hamlet. It consists of a few houses. And the third type of rural settlement is village. It consists of more than 100 houses and about 500 to 5000 people live over there. And now we are discussing functions of rural settlement. In rural settlement people are involved in primary activities like agriculture mining forestry fishing and crafts work they are also involved in some commercial activities like small shops local markets a school and a small post office a mosque is also there to spread religion and morality and it's time to recap Today we talked about rural settlements which means living in a small area. Then we talked about types of rural settlements. There are three types of rural settlements: farmstead, hamlet, and a village. Then we talked about functions of rural settlements and there are two types of functions. One is the primary function and the other is commercial. In the primary function people do some activities like agricultural activities mining fishing and craft work and in commercial activities there are some small shops local markets and a small post office works over there and it was all about today's topic let's take our learning Enjoy learning and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.